Iran is going to unveil the newest version of its homegrown missile defense system Baber 373 that outperforms the Russian-made S-400 anti-aircraft weapon system, an Iranian general said. In comments at a televised interview on Sunday night, a former head of the Iranian Defense Ministry's aerospace organization said local experts are developing a new generation of Baber 373. The newest version of Baber 373, which will be unveiled soon, has capabilities that outstrip the S-400, Brigadier General Mahdi Farahi added. He noted that Iran is making advances in the missile defense industry and can achieve considerable progress in this sector. The general highlighted the Islamic Republic's advances in missile production, saying the country has made a special liquid fuel for missiles that is as durable as solid fuels, allowing the projectiles to be stored for longer periods of time. Iran unveiled Baber 373 in August 2019. The long-range air defense system is capable of detecting up to 100 targets, tracking 60 of them, and engage with six concurrently. A distinguishing feature of Baber 373 is its vertical launching system with square launchers, mostly used for air defense on warships. Baber 373 uses a long-range phased array fire control radar, dubbed Marriage 4. The air defense system employs three different types of missiles to hit targets at various altitudes. In 2019, Iran unveiled its indigenously developed Baber 373 long-range air defense system, whose capabilities are claimed to be on par or better than those of the Russian S-300 or the U.S. Patriot. The country also possesses the Road Mobile Radar Guided S-300 Air Defense System, procured through a 2015 deal with Russia. However, that may soon change if Russia goes ahead with the sale of S-400 to Iran, which has been rumored to take place for quite some time. Recently, the Russian ambassador to Iran reportedly said the country will have no problem selling Tehran, an advanced air defense system, when the UN arms embargo on the Islamic Republic expires. Levin Zagarian, while speaking to a local newspaper in Iran, brushed off the threat of US sanctions and said Russia was willing to consider any weapon requests from the Islamic Republic. As you know we have provided Iran with S-300. Russia does not have any problem to deliver S-400 to Iran, and it did not have any problem before either the Times of Israel quoted the ambassador as saying. That could change the whole game in the Middle East for the US-led allies, particularly Israel, posing a formidable challenge to their assets in the region. The new S-400 variants reportedly use a new generation of digital processors, computer networking and radar frequency detection. These along with new upgrades on the older version are reported to be a credible threat to the 5th gen stealth fighters and B-2 bombers. The upgraded S-400s and of course S-500s could be a reliable deterrent to a vast range of US aircraft.
According to an assessment by the national interest, the real danger with upgraded S400s likely pertains to computer processing speeds, the extent to which they are networked to one another. If an ability to maintain a track on an aircraft improves at higher speeds over greater ranges due to an ability to more quickly integrate and network information then planes could be more vulnerable, even if the hardware or munitions themselves have not changed much. For instance, its high-speed data link technology improves the ability for one air defense location to find and share details with another node within a broader system, then broader areas could become vulnerable, and the normal radar evading advantage of flying at high speeds could be minimized it adds.